We're here at Meek's RV in Acampo, California. And we're looking at the 2020 Lance 1575 and 1475 trailers. This Lance 1575 weighs 3,207 pounds and has a maximum cargo rating of 493 pounds, which gives it a tow rating of 3,500 pounds. My first impression of this trailer is that it's very roomy. It has a big slide out. This sink is pretty big and it has a nice cover so that you can use the counter space. This trailer has the optional microwave. There's a three burner propane stove and this trailer has the optional oven. I love these handy trays for storing cutlery. The dinette converts into a bed that is slightly smaller than an RV full-size bed and is listed as having a sleeping capacity of four. I think two small people or two children would fit on this 46 inch by 78 inch bed. The dinette turns into a bed and this is on the slide out and so that makes it room enough for four. And honestly, it's probably enough for two adults and two children because it looks like it makes into a pretty small bed. And of course, there's a full-size queen on this side and this, I'm telling you, this is not memory foam. This is a real mattress right there. It comes with the optional Dometic air conditioner and a skylight, as well as the fantastic roof vent. It's really a bonus when an RV this small and this light has a dry bath. This is an adjustable shower curtain, so that when you're using the bathroom, you can just put that away. And then it has an RV bathtub, which is not good for me to take a bath in or for you to take a bath in, but if you have small children, it's a great place to put them to take a bath or to rinse your feet off or what have you. The toilet area, in my opinion, is kind of small and it's smaller than the 1475. The shower's bigger, but the toilet's smaller. And the area to get into the door is very tiny so if you're a larger person you might struggle getting into that space right there it feels really big with the slide out but i'm not sure you can get to the bathroom with the slide all the way in This five cubic feet, three-way refrigerator is huge for a trailer this size. As you walk in, there are these nice wall hooks and there's lots of windows letting in that light. Okay, these blinds, um, shade blind, like for daytime use, pulls from the top. At nighttime, 
blind pulls from the bottom. So these swivel chairs are really great to sit in. But you can also get a bench that folds into a bed. And that bench would give you the option of having a third person in this trailer. So it has a really nice dry bath, which I think is great with the curtain. It's small, but very functional. It has a very small sink and a vanity. There's a towel rack, convenient, and a couple hooks right there. And then it has a nice vent fan. And um, there's the toilet right next to the shower. There's definitely enough room to be comfortable when you're seated on the toilet. It's the inside of the vanity. A little bit of storage room in there. And a convenient wall outlet right there by the vanity and the medicine cabinet. The bed's a deluxe clean inner spring mattress with a pillow topper. So the Lance 1475 has a five cubic foot refrigerator, which is super big in my opinion. This model comes standard with a three burner range and this particular one has the optional oven. It also has the optional microwave. There's a fairly deep sink with a faucet that has a pull out handle. another wall outlet, and plenty of storage. So this particular 1475 comes with the air conditioner, which to me is absolutely imperative to have. There's also an additional fan. Okay, this trailer comes equipped with a smart jack on the tongue. So the smart jack has a hitch height memory. Underneath this aerodynamic cover is the propane tank. Okay, this has a large storage compartment, magnetic catch, also has a pull-out drawer, which is really nice. And if you have children that are loud at night, they can sleep in here. This is the uh, stinky slinky compartment for the, your sewer hose. It has a, a connection for an external solar panel. It has an external propane connection for your barbecue or your propane fire pit. It comes with alloy wheels. It also has the desirable Goodyear Endurance trailer tires. It has a double entry step. This is the vent for the Truma water heater. Outdoor shower. This is your water connections. So this is a flush valve. 
And this is your fresh water inlet, don't get those confused. Or you may have your toilet overflowing on the floor. This is where your shore power cord connects. This is your cable TV connections, satellite dish. This is where the black water and gray water valves are at, and this is where you connect your sewer hose. These here are for draining the water out of the system for winterizing. It's lightweight molded plexiglass windows. Hey, if you'd like to see more videos like this one, hit the subscribe button.